the Deauville Film Festival, which used to be exclusively devoted to American cinema, now also has a distinctly French accent. Since last year, the organizers invite a selection of titles from the Cannes Film Festival, including many French films due to be released in the coming months. This year, the chic, ultra chic Normandy Resort will welcome Charlotte Gainsbourg as president of the jury and also give her the opportunity to introduce the film she made about her mother, Jane Birkin, Jane by Charlotte. It's Gansborough's first experience behind the camera, and staying close to home, she decided to highlight her relationship with her mother, the legendary Jane. From a concert in Tokyo in 2018 to October last year, she follows her for almost three years, creating an intimate work that aspires to help the two women bond. Birkin, who's now age 74, is revealed in a mix of joys and sorrows. Charlotte sets out to explore the relationship by following her in her daily life between the Parisian flat and the family home in Brittany. With the help of a cinematographer and sometimes on her own with a small camera, Charlotte engages in what is an intimate conversation with Jane and tests her ability to renew the dialogue with her mother from whom she had become somewhat estranged following Charlotte's sojourn in America. At one point, Jane had wanted to stop the project, but then she reversed her decision, apparently with no hard feelings on either side. Edited by the two women in a linear fashion, the film was shot in Tokyo, France and New York and ended in October last year, which was a date significant with meaning because it corresponded with Charlotte's definitive decision to return to Paris from the States. The Deauville Film Festival, that's the red carpet you can see behind me, opens on the 3rd of September and continues until the 12th. This exclusive clip from Jane by Charlotte doesn't have any subtitles, but in it, Jane explains why she had her hair cut extremely short at the start of her singing career, because she didn't want people to be distracted by her appearance. Rather, she preferred that they listen to the words of the songs. She noted also that it was suggested if she went too far, she might be mistaken for a man. And for Jane, that indeed might have been a step too far. Et pourquoi les cheveux courts à ce point? Pourquoi ça te plaît autant, autant chez les autres que chez toi? Pour le Bataclan, c'était parfait parce que je voulais enlever tout ce qui était les attributs féminines, poupées, quoi. C'était un vrai désir. Comme si tu faisais une croix sur toutes ces photos qu'on te connaît de toi d'avant. Pas aussi tôt. Pas aussi dramatique que ça, mais 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 je voulais que les gens écoutent les mots et la le... façon que je chantais vraiment bien et qu'on a arrêté de parler de mon apparence. Oui, d'accord. Et je m'en souviens que ma mère a dit mmh, ça va là parce que tu fais garçon, mais attention parce que Bientôt tu vas faire homme. Et je me suis dit, oula, peut-être elle a raison. 